Welcome to Dollar Store Gaming. This is Sweatshop. What a lovely title screen. It is normally 99 cents purchased for 76. Dev Duck. God, I hope that's the name of the company. Okay, let's go. Your goal, hire more workers. Hire more workers, produce shirts for you. Upgrade your equipment to earn more, make money by collecting the shirts. Okay. Um. Oh. Oh. Uh, let's hire a worker. Okay. Oh my god, I got an achievement. Man, Minecraft Steve has fallen on some hard times. I'm kinda loving the music. Oh, okay. I see. When that square appears, that means I can collect it to make some money. This song is kinda creepy. Wow, there's a lot of stuff to get out of here. This music is really making me want to go to the lobby and buy myself a snack. Just just throwing that out there. Uh, this seems incredibly simple. And by simple, I mean boring. Okay, now I have enough. Hooray! So this kind of seems like a modified clicker game. You know, like a cookie clicker or something like that. But with cookie clicker, you could at least get going pretty quickly. You know, and there was you could proactively click to get more stuff. And this one, I just feel like I'm... Sitting around and waiting a lot. More. God damn it, I'll never become a baron of industry like this. Oh wait. I got an achievement. Platform. What are you? What does that do? There's also not a lot of feedback to let me know exactly what everything does. There has to be more to this, right? I, I actually kind of like clickers, but... There has to be more to this thing, right? Part of me does want to keep playing this game because I am... I do like clickers. I've gotten into periods where I get really into cookie clicker or clicker heroes or whatnot. But it feels like for a clicker, it's taking so long to get anywhere. There must be a way to get more... More, uh... More. Just more. I, I just want to see what material does. It has to do something exciting, right? That's when the gameplay of this kicks in. That's when this will all be worth it. Right? I'm actually actively playing Pokemon Moon right now while I wait for the, uh... My materials to build up. I do recommend Pokemon Moon, but I don't really know if that would count under Dollar Store Gaming. If you can find it for a dollar, go for it. Material, what do you do? I guess I don't know what I was expecting, but I was hoping for something more exciting. So, the question is, is Sweatshop worth a dollar? Nah. Clickers can be quite fun, but first off, I don't like the idea of paying for a clicker game. There's really not a whole lot of gameplay in them, let's be honest. Or super cheap, and honestly, a dollar for this is very expensive. But even in the realm of clickers, this one is kind of boring. Like, the progression is so slow that it just doesn't feel like I'm getting anywhere. If you can't get enough clickers, maybe check it out, but not for a dollar. Wait till it goes on sale. Seven, even 76 cents is pushing it. If you want to get a clicker game and pay like 50 cents for it, I would say if you're super into clickers, then yeah, it'd be worth it. But, anything other than that? Nah. Just go play Cookie Clicker. Go away. Square? I got it! I'm so good at this game. But now what? I need another worker. 